let's look at how we can build recommendation strategy flows using Flow Builder to expose next best action recommendations of the optimal point to the optimal person. So what I'm looking at here is a traditional standard, good old fashioned recommendation record. And this recommendation record has a name and description. It's got the ability to associate uh, an image with it. This one has a custom formula field. Uh, and importantly, it's also got uh, an action flow uh, that will be run uh, when the user clicks accept or reject. And what I want to do here is I want to invite users to try Slack Connect, um, but I don't want all my users uh, to get this invitation. I only want users that contacted me to create cases via email. So let's take a look at a case. You can see here that a service agent looking at this case will see this next best action component. Uh, and uh, they are being given the opportunity to accept it. And if the case origin happens to be something other than email, then that recommendation vanishes. And so how is that? And then, and then if the user, uh, that they're, if the customer that, they're, that the agent is talking to says, yes, I would like to know more, uh, the agent can click accept and run a flow. And this flow might have a form to fill out or it might make a call to an API, um, uh, a whole bunch of possibilities. So this is the standard look and feel of next best action, but it's been built in a different way. Instead of using the uh, traditional strategy builder, it uses flow builder and gets a bunch of additional features uh, that uh, flow builder can offer. So let's take a look at what's going on. If we, if we click edit page and look at how this next best action component is configured, you can see that it's got strategy source set to flow builder instead of strategy builder. So you can still use uh, existing strategies that were built with strategy builder, uh, but we recommend that you use flow builder. We're pointing at a flow called my recommendation flow. All right, so let's look at what this flow is doing. It starts by loading in possible recommendations. And that's basically done with a standard get records loading in the recommendation object. It also loads the case in from the ID that was passed in from the page that, that the component will be in so that we can have access to all of the fields of the case. And we use that to see if the case origin is set to email. Now, if it is, and what we're doing here is we're using a standard assignment element to add the existing recommendation to the set of output recommendations. So notice that there's this variable called output recommendations. This was actually automatically created because this particular flow is a specific type of flow. It's not a regular screen flow or a regular auto-launched background flow. This is a flow of type recommendation strategy. So let's back up a step and look at how you create one of those. If I click the new flow, new flow button and I click all plus templates, you can see that recommendation strategy is a new flow type that's now available. And when you create a new recommendation strategy, it automatically creates output recommendations. Think of this as the, as the sort of um, box that is containing, is intended to be shipped out of your flow with all of the winning recommendations. Uh, so it, all, we all, it also auto creates um, uh, a placeholder to receive the record ID because the expectation is that you're generally going to be on the record page, pass in the record ID. Uh, and that's otherwise, it's kind of up to you. You can do whatever you want inside of here, uh, but these are automatically created for you uh, to make it a little easier uh, to build these recommendation strategy flows. And you can see that it shows up here. It's actually called process type here in the UI. Um, and when we activate that, and then it will show up 
uh, it will work, show up here, be selectable, and display recommendations. So, uh, so all we have to do, because we started with recommendation records, all we have to do is uh, assign them, uh, assign them to uh, the output recommendations. So that's a, that's the simple example of how to create uh, a recommendation strategy flow using Flow Builder, which is now the recommended way to use next best action to help make optimal recommendations.